Well, the county holds meetings every Wednesday to give an update on COVID-19. During yesterday's meeting, a reporter asked Dr. Wilma Wooten to describe how San Diego County can improve to advance through California's reopening process. She said to advance through the reopening tiers, we must follow the government's orders. Take a listen. Well, I know we sound like a broken record, but the strategies, really those are, are they're simple, but they are tried and true, and we are seeing the evidence uh, and the impact that these best practices have, even uh, as we enter the flu season, uh, with the number of influenza-like illnesses showing up in the emergency room. While a large number of the community uh, is definitely adhering, there are some individuals and some groups, some businesses uh, that are not. So we ask that all businesses uh, hold their clients and their patrons accountable. Uh, we ask that individuals adhere to these guidances. We ask that people not have uh, large parties. Uh, that's one factor uh, that has been uh, pervasive throughout this pandemic, having parties, uh, particularly renting Airbnbs or in your backyard. All of those, those matters, those factors, those actions, those behaviors, all of them matter. And if people will just, and I know there's fatigue, I certainly understand that. But as we've also stated, this is a marathon, it is not a sprint. And by practicing these behaviors for a few weeks and then stopping it, it sends us into the yo-yo uh, situation as well. So this is, a, a, will have to become a way of life until vaccines uh, are available. So thank you. Here are the latest coronavirus numbers in San Diego County. Health officials reported another 330 new positive test results, four new deaths, all four in their uh, 70s plus, all four with underlying conditions. Of the 11,000 tests given, 3% came back positive. The case fatality rate remains at 1.6%.